What's Brandon? I can't remember Brandon now. Um, the Denali, yeah, Denali Chuli Stat. Uh, comes in 55 IBUs and 5.8, I think, ABV. I'm not sure. Anyway, uh, yeah, it's a stout. It's a, uh, a dry stout, kind of like a Guinness. And I just looked it up. It is does have a nitrogen in it. So it's going to be nice and creamy as opposed to just a carbon dioxide type thing. So let's, uh, let's go ahead and pop this thing. Yeah, I've oh, got this from the Brown Jug in Fairbanks on tap. Right, really cheap, $4.50 for this whole 32 ounce growler. Ooh, look at that, nice and bright. You want to do the honors? Spill it in like that the last time, good. Try to, try to pour kind of fast because it is a... Uh, yeah, two fingers don't really work. Yeah, because it is a uh, nitrogen, that way it'll get ahead, otherwise it won't get ahead on. A little bit ahead, not much, but a little bit. Just like the last one, what was the last one we had? Um, I don't remember what. Anyway, we've had so many of them. Who's the asylum? Or something like that. Um, the Abyss. Abyss. The Abyss. It also has no head on it. So, all right, yeah, you can see this is also a, a real black one. Look at that, black as can be. All right, can't see nothing through it. I think the other one looked a little bit dark. It was a, it was a black, 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 but you still can't see through it whatsoever. Yeah, I think the other one looked a little thicker. That's what it is. And I think because this one has nitrogen, that may be part of it. It's uh, nice and creamy, so. Uh, Yep, nice dark brown head. Go ahead and whip it. <coughs> Don't snort it, though. just whip it. <laughs> okay, it kind of tilts it more yeah, than I thought it would. Not good. What you get? What you get off that? Definitely get some uh, roasted malts. Yeah. You, know, you get the roasted stuff, you get a little bit of maybe slight chocolatey. That's what I got. I got a little bit of chocolate in the background. Mm -hmm. maybe, maybe a coffee ish smell also. Of course, stouts are known for that. It's usually what they, uh, you know, what they are supposed to smell like and taste like. All right. You want to go ahead and uh, gulp it on down? All right. Let's launch it. It's good. I like it better than the other one. Yeah. I don't think it's as thick as the other one. Um, and that may be another reason why I like it. Maybe a little bit better. Yeah. Um, of course, I had it. Was it IBU, IBUs on that? Can't remember. It was. It was a lot more IBUs, but um, I think this, the, the yeah, alcohol percentage was a lot more too. Yeah. yeah, I think it was. If I'm not mistaken, eleven percent. Yeah, it was eleven percent. Eleven percent alcohol. This is only five point. I think five point eight. Um, yeah, still, still chocolatey and a little bit. Um, you know, you get the roasted malts, a little coffee-ish. Like I said, not as you know, it's not as thick. Yeah, it's a lot easier to go, to go down. It goes down a lot easier than that other stuff does. Um, the other stuff that uh, the abyss is definitely one you want to sit out, maybe in the snow camping or something like that, and yeah. sit around a fire drinking it, warm you up. So, right, not too bad. And like I said, four fifty for a thirty-two ounce on tap. Nice stuff. So anyway, good stuff from Denali. You know where that's located? I know where Denali, the mountain range, but I mean the brewing company. I'm not sure. I would assume somewhere probably in Denali, somewhere. Yeah, somewhere. Maybe. Yeah, so that would make sense being at Denali. But uh, anyway, all right, there we go. Peace.